Developer Square Enix is rebooting the Tomb Raider franchise, and the first game in the installment is an origin story, which means it focuses its lenses on who Laura Croft is exactly, and how she became the ass-kicking brunette explorer we've all grown to love since 1996. This version of Laura is one hardened by the traumatic experiences she foregoes on this disaster of an adventure. It starts off as an exploration trip with a crew and a bunch of friends that gets shipwrecked by a storm and stuck on a mysterious island. set out on this new terrain to find help, rations, and your crew, you actually find that they're being round up and slaughtered for some kind of ritual by the island's natives. The island is of East Asia locale, thus providing a very cool scene to explore as you leap from jagged mountain peaks into the environment's many rivers that often carve out deep caverns containing history of a civilization long gone. The game has a horror survival element integrated into it from start to finish. While this isn't something we typically see in a Tomb Raider game, it is a necessity in the story of Origins as it drives Laura's character development forward. The story is very linear, with near to no room for actual exploration, but breathtaking graphics, fun gameplay, and classic style puzzles to solve serve up a Tomb Raider game fans of the franchise cannot afford to pass up on. The story's deep, emotionally intense style, the likes of which the franchise has never seen, is worth its weight in gameplay. Cutscenes blend in so beautifully, I find it hard to tell the difference of what's actually running on the in-game engine and what's CGI. The campaign can be very linear at times, which locks you into a state of near to no exploration. But breathtaking graphics, fun gameplay, and classic style puzzles to solve serve up a Tomb Raider game fans of the franchise cannot afford to pass up. Square Enix does a reboot right and scores a 9 out of 10.